Hey guys, the YF39 here, and I'm back from what could be considered a break or a just complete stop in recording. I just haven't been doing much lately, however, I'm back, clearly, with Borderlands 2 up in this bitch. But, um, sorry about the bad quality. I don't have them, I, I couldn't get it on the computer because it's not good enough. I do have a flap so I can record good on the computer, I just don't have the quality. The qu good quality computer. But I'm getting a new one for Christmas so all of my Let's Plays will be done on the computer after Christmas, but for now. So, you want to hear another story, eh? One where the very fate of Pandora hangs in the balance. It's not too bad, I'm telling you anyway. Okay. First, there was the boat. An alien prison offered with a mystical key. To the warrior's open, the offered just a container of tentacles and disappointment. They vanished into the wasteland, searched that the vault held no treasure at all. They were wrong. The vault opening triggered the growth of iridium, a priceless alien element. Soon, the rare and valuable mineral emerged all across Pandora. Its appearance attracted many, including the Hyperion Corporation. They came to Pandora to mine Iridium and bring order to the savage planet. Through their excavations, Hyperion uncovered evidence of an even greater vault. Their leader vowed to find it, to use its power to civilize the borderlands once and for all. But Hyperion weren't the only ones searching for the next vault's alien power. The call of danger and loot is not so easily resisted. Certain warriors came to Pandora in droves to uncover its hidden away. Some would call them adventurers. Others call them fools. But I call them vault hunters. Our story begins with them, and with a man named Handsome Jack. Okay then. Now, I'm playing as Salvador the Gunzerker, because everyone I've talked to said, ah, he's the worst character. I'm here to prove you wrong. Surely can't phase like enemies into the air, or he doesn't have a turret that like shoots people and can stick to ceilings. And he can't disappear. But he can dual wield rocket launchers for Christ's sake. That, is, that can't be taken lightly. And here we have the opening with the skag. Go on skag, get up. Nope. So I'm playing this on my own. Purely because I don't have headbutt. I don't have what it, like, none of my mates have this basically, is what I'm looking for. While that blows, I'm just gonna... They got hit by a train, awesome music starts playing, stupid midgets. You will come to hate the midgets on this game, their voices are so annoying. Here's me. 
look at that. How can you not like that? Salvador the Gunzerker. I'm running this game semi-blind. It's Saturday today. I got it yesterday on a day release in England. And here we go. Salvador action skill gun zerking. Combat style bigger guns charge. Phase lock. Control the ebb and flow of the battlefield. Deception. Long range sniping or slitting floats. And sabre turret. Keep to cover and never give the enemy a chance. We're playing as Salvador. Head. Salvador. Geared. Like in bold and for every clash you have a vault veteran, which is something from the first game. That sledgehammer. And we're going for the last one, which is Pandora and Legend, named Salvador. talking about but I don't even know. Wait a minute. You're not dead. Yes. Now I can get off this glacier. Claptrap, your metaphorical ship has finally come in. Allow me to introduce myself. I am a L4 P T Stewart Bond. Oh no. My friends call me Claptrap. Or they would if any of them were still alive or had existed in the first place. Oh, I've got something for you. Limited playthrough because I've played through some of it. I tried to speed run it as a, as a gun zerker just to see what the ending was. It's not that easy. When you're level 13, fighting level 17, you can dual wheel whatever you want. It's not going to work. Well done. Your ability to walk short distances without dying will be handsome, Jack's downfall. Just he shoots you, just walk up to him. No, and he just dies. Makes sense. So this two things, okay. First thing, this, this the, the play style is a lot like Borderlands One still. It retains some of the same elements, like the way you play through. Who keeps a dollar in a locker? And the second thing, he said, just little added security that security box, yeah, that security door. Look at something. There's a hole in his goddamn roof. Sorry about the mask. Everything's good. What is that? Look. I mean, 
He hasn't got an eye. Whoa. Yeah, this? Cult of the Vault. One badass rank. Badass ranks. <laughs> okay. So, I've been playing for this a lot. And um, badass ranks stack. So my badass rank is actually 539. And these are my bonus stats with health, shield capacity, gun damage, all that stuff. Every, every time you get a cert, every time you amass, oh, you can disable bonus stats. Nah. Every time you do um, certain challenges, you get badass ranks for them. And you, when you amass certain badass ranks, you get badass tokens. And you can redeem these tokens for different things, like maximum health, more gun damage, and all that stuff. Great! Just let me get this door open and Let's we'll channel back to Claptrap's First thing I'm doing, just because, no, not achievements, just because Claptrap's voice is starting to annoy me. Oh, listen to this. That is what every midget psycho in this game sounds like. And there are so many of them. Over. It Did is you horrible. Let me know if I'm going to run into anything. Ah! I'll just assume you didn't see that. No, I didn't do that. But, um, we 12 minutes. Glass bike with us. But, um, I'm going to end it here, guys. Episode 1. Thanks for watching, and remember to like, favourite, and subscribe. I will be putting these up daily because it's a new game, and I want to try and get it like up as quick as possible. Because to be honest, I want I have a feeling this game is going to be my lucky break on YouTube because this is the newest game out right now. So me putting it up, hopefully, will get me views instead of me putting up like on uh, FIFA 10. That was one of the first games I saw in my list. FIFA 10 isn't the best. It's it's three years old now because FIFA 13 is coming out soon. But um, thanks for watching, guys. This is yet. This is the White House 39. Signing out.